Alright, how's it going everyone? AZ and Bonkai here. As you may already have seen, a second, far more detailed trailer for Crossfire HD dropped about a week ago. In this video, I wanted to run down a bunch of stuff that I saw in the trailer and have a discussion about what we should be expecting from the game. If you would like to see the trailer for yourself, head on over to the link I've included in the description box of this video. But yeah, let's get started. Now the first thing I noticed right away is how much faster paced the game seems to be. Your player has the ability to run based on what is featured in the gameplay footage, something that's never been introduced in the original Crossfire game. So that already is a major change in CFHD. Here we also have footage of some iconic maps and weapons being used. I see the AK-47, XM-1014, and Scarlet being used. Really love the new character model and weapon designs, they're looking really polished. This next part is pretty crazy, we have the map Overpass. Now, I'm not sure if this has any relevance to the map in Counter-Strike with the same name, but it looks like the entire bridge is collapsing or something, so I'm wondering whether this is actually part of the multiplayer or an aspect of what may be some sort of story mode. Either way, it looks really amazing. This next scene is from the Duo Deathmatch mode, featuring the 1v1 rifle map. Looks to be very fast-paced, a smaller map with close quarter combat, but did anyone else notice the player model's arm? It really kind of threw me off that this player's hand um, or arm has some sort of maybe assassination list or something, not really sure. But up next is some search and destroy footage on the map Cold Storage. I see an XM1014 being used and it seems like there will be destructible objects like the window that gets shattered and the paint cans that explode. This next part of the trailer showcases a new map called Embassy in tactical bomb mode. Looks really interesting and something about it kind of gives me a Rainbow Six Siege kind of vibe. Excited to try it out. Now this is when the trailer goes full on ramble. We have footage of the map Prison, one of the most iconic sniping maps in Crossfire. But it looks like you can swim underneath to get from one side of the map to the other which is entirely new. Also, what really caught my attention were the gloves. Now I'm doubting those are default gloves for the player model so maybe glove skins confirmed. We've also got this insane map, the players using the iconic Kukri melee. But the map starts to tilt or something, dropping you down a tunnel full of water. Looks freaking insane. And I can't even comprehend what I'm seeing here. It looks like another melee only map, but there's a tiger running around in the map. Um, I think this is part of the special weapon mode, which is something that's new being introduced. More gameplay footage on the map Greece, which is clearly the map Egypt in the original Crossfire game. What I did find interesting is the AK-47 used in this clip is not the default AK-47 skin, which most likely will mean weapon skins similar to CSGO being introduced into the game. We also have probably one of the things I'm most excited for, footage of the death run mode. Looks absolutely insane. Um, but wrapping up this video, we have an RPG shooting some mech robot, a freaking arrow and bow being equipped, insane mutation transformation in nano mode, freaking samurais fighting each other mid-air, more Black Widow footage, and a possible skin leak for the M4A1S. I'm really excited for Crossfire HD. The second trailer has really convinced me that this won't be some half-assed remake, but something that the developers are really taking their time with. Anyways, that's basically all for this video. If you enjoyed, make sure you give this video a thumbs up or share it. Would appreciate it and I'll see you guys later.